Alright, hey everybody, how you doing? What's up? We are continuing our playthrough of Crimson Gem Saga on the PSP. So, uh, we have to enter Fargan and figure out what's going on in Fargan. My grandson made this snowman. Isn't it great? He's gonna be a great sculptor someday. Ha 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 ha. Welcome to Fargan. <laughs> this is my first time here as well. And yet, it feels like home. Yeah. Acquired 12... 1,500 guilders. Acquired Takoyaki times 10. Ah, uh, Latin's economy is so horrible right now. Will I even be able to buy myself a fish cake? Oh, wow, they must be really poor. They can't even afford a cake. I'm gonna be a fish cake maker when I grow up. Then I'll be able to eat them anytime I want. Oh, this kid's a genius. He's gonna be rich. <laughs> Today's weather is pretty decent, not as cold as usual. Or is it because I've got my mink muff? <laughs> Ooh, rich ladies. Oh my god, she's struggling. Ah, don't let go of me. Don't, huh? I promise I won't let go, so please open your eyes. She's learning how to skate. I'm a rising star for Fargan's Shack Shack skating team. Nice. Let's see what this boy is doing. Fargan's great because you can skate all year round. Oh, I guess it's always cold here. What are you talking about? My granddaughter is better at it. What are you talking about? My grandson is better at- Oh my god, they're arguing about, about who's better at ice skating. Really? Is this what we really need to be arguing about right now? Acquired a huge bomb times five and two elixir. Nice. Staying active is the key to beating this cold weather. Okay. Can you buy me a doll, please? Oh my god. They, they have a huge house. And this little girl's asking me to buy her a doll. Oh my god, this is story time. Welcome. I am Chief Murdoch. Are you adventurers? What brings you here to this rural area? I used a letter from Hannibal. Well, now this is from Colonel Hannibal. He's an old friend of mine, you know. So, he's written you a letter of introduction. Let's see now. Hmm, I see. So that's what happened. Have you heard of the Giant's Top? I don't think I've heard of any place like that. Oh, are you talking about the Ziggurat? Ziggurat? That doesn't sound like any place called Giant's Top, Spinel. Ah, uh, yes, the Ziggurat. That's what some people call it. It was created by an ancient god. If you reach the top, you will be able to find what you're looking for. But my sources say there's nothing at the top. Lies. You need the giant scroll to get to the top. And I know nobody's gotten their hands on it. Do you have it? This town, this very town is tasked with guarding it. So you're going to give it to us? Unfortunately, it's not here. I'm getting a little long in the... <laughs> I'm getting a little long in the tooth. So six years ago, I outsourced protection of the scroll. It's at the bottom of the Silvernian dungeon. I figured it was tougher to go through a dungeon than it was to beat up an old man. So do you have anything to give us access to the dungeon? Yes, I give you my permission to get the giant scroll. What? That's it? Oh, I can give you advice too. Now is a good time to go. The creatures that typically are active in this cold weather have just only begun stirring. You should be able to deal with them in this state. By the way, can you tell us of the Wolfen Fortress Magical Bearer? Is there any way to overcome it? That answer can only be found at Ziggurat. You will know when you arrive. Well, I guess we're headed to the Silvernian dungeon then. Yep. We have to go through another dungeon? I don't like the sound of it. Everywhere we go in this dungeon. What do you expect? It's not like he's gonna hide the scroll in a buffet. Just get ready to leave. <laughs> if he hid it in a buffet, we'd find it faster. This should be just the kind of work for our infamous treasure hunter. <laughs> I'm gonna relax. Yes, but no. <laughs> Be careful! Those ice monsters are some of the fiercest freaking killers in the Monster Kingdom. Nice. We'll be careful. And I'll be there to help you in any way I can. That's good to hear. We'll make good use of your skills. <laughs> you have gained new information regarding the quest Wolfen Fortress. You have accepted the quest Ziggurat. So let's see Wolfen Fortress and Ziggurat. The new information. Wolfen Fortress, there's something at the top of the Ziggurat that can help us figure out what we need to do, according to Murdoch and, and Ziggurat. The bottom floor of the Silvernian Dungeon has a scroll we need in order to gain access to the top of Ziggurat. Awesome. In order to prevent disease, you need to ventilate your home, no matter how cold it is. I guess that makes sense. Welcome, sir. Please have some tea before tea time passes us by. Oh, I got the blues. My grandma only made clothes for the cat. Woman never made me a pair of mittens. My kids all grew up wearing clothes that I made. Hmm. <laughs> Wolves often roam around the northern mountains. Don't even think about wandering around here. Where is that old fart? Brr, it's so cold out. I have a lot of imitation flowers that will look fresh, even in the coldest weather. Please feel free to look around. 
I, I returned the book that contained my love letter for Catherine. What should I do? Everyone is going to find out. I have a lot on my mind. Please leave me alone. I'm Juana's assistant. You can learn a lot from her. Oh, Cameron. It may be cold outside, but in here we're burning with passion for each other. Fish cakes are the best when you're hungry. Welcome. You, what can I do for you? Let's forget about our worries. Throw back a pint and look forward to tomorrow. Fish cakes are the best when you're feeling lonely. Really? Fish cakes are the best when it's cold outside. If you feel like something soupy, fish cake soup is the way to go. Damn, all they eat in this town is fish cakes. Aaron, it's too cold to go out today. I'm so bored. Won't someone come play with me? Whitney, if a cat and a dog fight, who will win? When my parents fight, my mom always wins. Acquire two tents and three kitsune udons. Nice. I live in Habsburg and I've come all the way here to buy the best weapon there is. <laughs> He's the main man, Killian. Mighty medicine. Nice. Lever A has been set to off. Lever B has been set to on. Lever C has been set to off. D is activated. B is on. D is on. A is on. B is off. C is on. So let's do B now. B is on. C is on. Oh, yes. We did it. Yes! You got a third. Finally, right? <gasps> There's a chest. Five safe havens. Walk is right. So we have this chest, which is key one. Yes, the second key. Go down this way. Ah. We have Shiavana. Key three. You're going to get key four. Ooh, a door. I used one of the keys to open a door. Nice. I had four of them, so we're good. Right, this is the second door. I use the key. Oh, what's this? We should be distributing mana points. Strength amulet. Okay. With the mana potions, use the key to open the door. The chest has acquired the giant scroll. We finally found the giant scroll. What's so great about this scroll anyways? Let's see. You can't read it, Gelt, can you? I'm stunned that I've never seen this kind of writing before. What kind of language is this? That's what makes it so wonderful. It must be worth at least one million Gelders. Ah, uh, it's a shame we can't sell it. So, we have to take this to the top of the Ziggurat, right? Let's head for the Warp Core location at Fargan. You have gained new information regarding the quest Ziggurat. Let's see that information. Ziggurat, okay. We've got the giant squirrel. Time to head to the top of Ziggurat and see what's waiting for us there. Alright, let's, let's go. Is this a warp out of here? Yep, let's exit. If you leave these premises, it will shut itself off. See what this guy is. Hi, I'm Ozma. I'm the traveling salesman. The Ziggurat is a scary place. Many people have gone inside, never to come back out. But all the people who brought my goods before heading in have made it out alive. Let's see. Ah, my body isn't what it used to be. So how come you're the one manning this warp core, warp core location? Aren't technicians supposed to be young women? That's just a marketing scheme. We put the pretty girls in crowded places to attract more customers. The older male warp core technicians are stuck in secluded places like this. Welcome to the Ziggurat, where your hopes and dreams can come true. <laughs> what is this place? This is a huge tower, where everything is still shrouded in mystery. No one knows when, why, or whom this thing was built. Some historians believe it was built to reach the gods, but many other theor theories also prevail. All I know is this place is filled with monsters that strike fear into even the bravest of adventurers. Who are you? My name is LaForge. <laughs> you already Star Trek? No? Okay. I'm a warp core technician, but current circumstances have me working here as a guide. You're not gonna ask me any more about... You're not gonna ask any more about ladies past, are you? 2250 Gelder and 5 Antidote. Let's speak to her. Have you been enjoying your visit to the Ziggurat? What do you guys do here? Leaving through the first floor entrance isn't the only way out of Ziggurat. We have transporters all over Ziggurat for adventurers to use any time you wish to exit. Don't worry, there's no fee. And, uh... How do they get up here? Did you forget? I'm a warp core technician. It's my job to know my way around Ziggurat. What is this? Galoran urine. Ah, oh, nasty. What is all this? Oddly, the experience had a recuperative effect. MP restored. What the hell? You smelled that urine to who yourself. That's so gross. Treasure has two tents. Oh, hey, look at her. 
Hehehe, he, he. so you're trying really hard to make it up the tower. You may be on the fourth floor, but how many more stairs are there until you get to the top? As you continue upwards, the monsters get more and more powerful. Let's see what's in this chest. There's a piece of paper with a message. Devil, there's a devil here. Acquired biscuit times 25 just before this. Is this the one with the 1590? Yes, it is. And a holy arrow. Holy smokes. We will see. We'll see what happens. Life sometimes moves fast. <gasps> Ooh, a chest. Will amulet. Oh, there's two treasure chests. Let's open the one to the right. 2200 gilders. The other chest exploded. Next floor. Ooh. Hee <laughs> hee. You like to live dangerously, don't you? What do we have to do now? The ziggurat is divided into different zones. Zone 1 extends from the ground to the 10th floor, which you've been traveling through so far. Zone 2, two starts on the 11th floor. However, there's a requirement to pass each zone. Seeking out other technicians in Latin might help meet those requirements. Alright. Do you want me to die? Hehehe, <laughs> no way, I'm just teasing you guys. It's my life on the line. <laughs> ziggurat Zone 1 has been cleared. Oh, hey, she's here. Congratulations, you've cleared zone one. Piece of cake. You're pretty confident. That's good. But keep this in mind. If you come back to the ziggurat, you'll start in zone two on the 11th floor. You won't be able to go back to the 10th floor. Once you set foot in the new zone, you can't go back to the previous one. What else is she going to say? Where's our gift? Oh, wow. Are you giving me a gift? I don't know what to say. Even though I prefer cash, I still appreciate it. Hehe, <laughs> what am I supposed to do with this? Ooh, I got his third. That's Latic. There we go. Oh, got his third. Ooh, acquired 2,700 and two angel feathers. Nice. Dang! Got him! Let's talk to this lady. Hello, long time no see. Can I get a different guide? I think I've been doing fine guiding you guys. I always give it my best effort. But don't you think it's a waste for a cute girl like me to sit alone in this tower all day? There's gotta be something else I can do where I can make a living and also enjoy my youth. Let's see. Seriously, it's time for a gift. Wow, you're a bold one. How about this? I'll give you a gift if you get to the top of this tower. No jokes this time, I promise. But I wonder how many stairs there will be to the top. Yes, third hit. Alright, we just have these two bruisers left. Third hit, let's go! On the right side. Nice. Oh, there's a chest. Aegis ring. To sell off everything that I'm not. That I don't have equipped. Because we've been getting a lot of equipment and stuff. Third hit. We've been getting a... Wow. I just keep getting them today. Let's get this chest. Molten ring. Are you getting claustrophobic yet? Stick to your day job. Sure, you finished zone 2, but don't get cocky. Zone 3 awaits you just past this point. If you feel you can't go any further right now, take a break and come back later. Uh, we actually have to go through this entire dungeon, so... Please, give me a gift. Jeez, will you stop bugging me? I promised you the gift. But only once you get to the top, okay? Anyways, I haven't figured out what to get you yet. Alright, now that we're in zone 3... Awesome if his attacks weren't dealing so little damage. Ooh, we did get a chest. Five huge bombs. Let's go! I'm on fire. Oh, yeah. We got Ooh, nice. We're getting a lot of the ultimate crits today, and I am for it. To back. 
damage. <laughs> enough to do Killian's uh, special, his ultimate. We have enough to do his cross slash move, which might. The YouTube video is gonna have so many of those uh, attacks in it. Oh wow. I mean, if I really wanted to, I could replay the bot and figure it out and math, but why? Nice, let's see what this chest is. 4,200 Gelders and a Miracle Potion times 5. Oh, wow. Of course it had to be against the enemy where he hardly damages it. See, this is actually effective. Holy damage to all enemies. Oh, I've never seen this before. Is it gonna kill them? Oh wow, it's a foot. A foot descended from the heavens. No <laughs> it was a foot. Congratulations, you finally made it to the top. Is this the top? Beyond this door is the very top of the cigarette. Many adventurers have tried to make it up here, but only few have succeeded. Unfortunately, there's really nothing up here, so I hope you're not disappointed. Don't be, there's a rumor that the place isn't the absolute top, so maybe you'll discover its secret. Wait, GIF GIF! I've got it here, just like I promised. I would have given it to you even if I didn't. This is for those who have made it to the top. Acquired a clown mask. Well, I've got to do all the way here, my job is done, and I must go back now. It's been fun. Good luck with everything. Bye. All the way. Oh, okay, they both lead to the same platform. So, just put the scroll on the top of this altar. That sounds about right. Try it. Now that you're agreeing with me, I don't know if it's such a good idea. <laughs> what? Damn it, Spinel. Why you gotta agree with me? Use the giant scroll. Let's see what happens. Oh! What's that, a book? Is it working? I don't know. A book fell from the sky. Or maybe that was the giant scroll I put. Look! It's a UFO. Hmm. It's like something secret. So this must be the entrance. Alright, let's go. I can't believe I'm looking at the path to Ziggurat's top floor. You have completed the quest. Ziggurat. Nice. So, um, let's see what quests we have left. We have the Wolfen Fortress. There's something at the top of the Ziggurat that can help us figure out what we need to do according to Murdoch. So the Wolfen Fortress was closed off to us. It's the last dungeon of the game, but we had to climb the top of the Ziggurat first uh, to get to it. And now that we've done it, let's see what item is up here that will help us. <gasps> oh, what's this? Story time! Let's go! Oh, we're all shocked. Why? Holy shit, look at all those enemies! Yipes! God, it's full of monsters! It's too dangerous here. We must find another route. Quick, turn back before they see us. <laughs> There's monsters in front and behind us. We can't go this way, way either. <laughs> ah, we're completely surrounded. I hope we have a fight. Let's fight. Now what? Should we charge them? No, you fool. There are too many. Hold your ground, everyone. Watch out. Here they come. That's... Um... What's happening? Is the Order of Light using some kind of magic? Huh? Who's using that powerful magic? Come on, let's finish off the rest of them. Was that Henson? In the name of heaven, we shall punish you. Take this. Henson is the magic user. Was that Henson? Huh. I'm very confused. I'm intrigued. I shouldn't have hit that one first. 
Let's just let's just do this quickly. I don't even know if this is a boss battle. You should have retreated. Whew, we survived. Whoa, voice acting. I've never come across anyone with magic that powerful. Who was that? It's probably Henson. Hmm? Someone is approaching. Is it another monster? It's Henson! We got him back! Well, it's not a monster. Do you know this mage? Yes. Hey, it's Henson! Why did she, like, have a little heart emote? I thought she liked Killian. I never thought I'd see you again. Hey, how are you guys doing? I should have known I'd randomly run into you in a dungeon. <laughs> That's how we first found him. Henson? I'm training. Same thing I've always been doing. Although, quite a few things have happened since I last saw you guys. What happened? What happened to you when we escaped from the execution? Yeah, you know how much we worried about you? That is true. I was a little bit worried about him. What do you mean, we? <laughs> Gouts! Be nice, Gouts! Uh, so tell us what happened, Henson. Well, eventually I was captured by the Order of Light. Damn. See, I knew he was safe. We had nothing to... Wait, you said you got captured? How'd you escape? I'm amazed that you're still alive. Is he working with the Order? <laughs> well, I'd love to tell you the full story, Elevated. but now is not the time. Oh, this place is kind of full of monsters. We gotta stop meeting in dungeons like this. Yeah, we first met him in a dungeon, so... <laughs> I guess we're even now that you've saved us in a dungeon. Yeah. Yeah, we can call it even. Though I'm pretty sure I won't need your help in a dungeon anymore. Damn. <laughs> Still arrogant as ever, I see. Yeah, Henson really hated hanging out with us. Well, it's good to have you back. You really seem to have changed for the better. He's the mage. Some of my recent exploits have mellowed me out a bit. Nice. He hasn't changed one bit in my eyes. Gouts. Gouts always got some smart shit to say. That's probably because your eyes are shot, old man. Oh, they always make fun of him for being old, too. Ah, impudent fool. Well, I guess it's nice to see that you haven't totally changed. Hanson, it's been a long time. It's good to see you again. Oh, I remember you. The Order does not have very nice things to say about you, by the way. Oh, damn. First of all, thank you for saving us. Well, what do you want to do now? He wants to join I us. I see you're still no fun, but at least you're not acting like you're always in charge. I wonder if his level would be like 20-something, because that's where we left him at. 20 or 30-something. Right now we're at close to like level 75, I would say, average. Well, so. Nice to see you all again. Don't tell me you're still looking for the Wicked Stones, are you? You got it. Still looking for those Wicked Stones. Damn. You're still looking for them, and you're still alive. You must be pretty strong too, then. Well... Count me in. Plus, that new cutie you added to your group made it a pretty easy decision. Asalora, she is, uh, I, I wouldn't say she's cuter than Spinel, but she's cute. She's a blonde. I am Asalora. <laughs> Killian and the others were kind enough to accept me into the group. And she's really proper. I am looking forward to working with you. I'm looking forward to working with you. Oh, yeah, he is. <laughs> it's odd that he's acting this nice in front of a lady. Though maybe it's just that Spinel wasn't his type. Oh! Ew, that's all men care about. Jeez. Ooh, it's the top of the ziggurat. What the hell is this? Welcome. I have been awaiting your arrival. You were awaiting our arrival? How did you know we were already coming? Yes, your destiny has led you here, to me. I have been granting the power of seeing people's destinies. Are, are you a god? Some have called me that, but I am simply Maju Zenin. Maju Zenin. Any other label placed upon me is not of my own accord. I have some knowledge to give you. The story of the past and the future. What do you know of the wicked stones that you are searching for? Well, they're dangerous magic artifacts that an ancient evil magic lord made. Just because someone in power tells you something doesn't make it true. The ancient wizard lord Ferenkis was not an evil being. Did you know the Latian Empire occupies the same area that the Elf Empire once occupied? His sin, in the mind of some, is the mere fact that he ruled the Elf Empire. 
He was not an entirely good ruler though. To make up for this, he created six wicked stones. The stones gave him the power to suppress rebellious thoughts and keep his citizens content. That's completely different from what I was told by the Order of Light. It is often said that the victor writes history, Killian. The victor doesn't always tell the truth. So the Cardinal lied to us? The Elf Empire was destroyed by the Lachaman Empire. The Lachaman Empire spawned the Latean Empire. The Latean has right... Wait. Latean has written history as they saw fit. Those bastards! <laughs> the Lachaman armies were constantly running raids on border cities and inadvertently found a stone. Then, the, when the Lachaman Empire discovered that there were six of these stones, they offered peace. What happened then? The offer of peace was a lie to focus their strategy on claiming the stones. They spent the time building their forces and discovering where the wicked stones were located. Through this, four out of the six wicked stones fell into the hands of humans. After five years of fighting the Lachaman Empire, the collapse of the mighty elf empire was inevitable. As the Lachaman forces closed in, Farinkis made a crucial decision. Ooh, do we get to go back in time? Nice. Wait, I remember this. I have no choice left. This is my only option. This is how the game started. He put like a baby in there, and I was wondering if it was the main character, but now I think it's Spinel. Because he's an elf and she's an elf. The world will be in ruins if this power falls into the wrong hands. This is the only way I can hope to redeem myself. At least maybe this young child will have the chance to escape this fate. Even if it's a slim chance, it's better than none at all. Please forgive me. And then he put it, yeah, it looks like a baby spinel. That's what I think. There's been something weird about her, something special about her the whole game. <laughs> Yo, for real, pretzels are mad good. <laughs> I had to drink too. <laughs> Farinkis transferred his souls, infusing it the crimson gem. Wait, Farinkis transferred his souls, infusing it the crimson gem. It's what people of your era commonly refer to as a wicked stone. All right, I see you elevated. Wait, he put his soul into a wicked stone? Correct. Well, partially correct. The wicked stones you are familiar with are actually fragments of one stone. Specifically, they're fragments of the stone that Ferenkis infused his soul into. If these parts of the stone are brought together again, Ferenkis will be able to return to this world. Dryden has been trying to resurrect him for quite some time. So that's why he's been trying to collect all the stones. Farinkis is a very powerful magic user. Stopping him would be an incredible task. But didn't humans completely destroy the Elf Empire? I don't see many elves around. If the Latane Empire is truly the aggressor here, isn't it natural that he would be seeking vengeance? Killian. People have differences through all of history and time. Who can say definitively what is right and what is wrong? All I know is that the choice is yours. Fate has decreed that you are to make this choice. This key will play a part. Take it. Acquire the Sage's Key. The six wicked stone fragments will soon be gathered at one place. The ceremony will be held at the top of Wolfland Fortress. Dryden has set up a powerful magical barrier to ensure that he won't be disturbed during the ceremony. Oh, nice. My part in this play has been completed. I will now depart. Before I go though, I will leave you two last things. Should you require a legendary sword, yes please, this will prove useful. Acquire the Amulet of Hope, and this will grant you access to a place where you can find a legendary suit of armor. Acquire the Amulet of Despair. The Amulet of Hope will allow you passage to an area of the Silvernian Dungeon. The Amulet of Despair will allow you the reverse ziggurat, inverse babble. You have accepted the quest hero sword. You have accepted the quest legendary cavalier armor. May these items make your journey... Wait, make your journey to your choice easier. Oh yeah, the fate of the world will be determined by you, so be resolute in your decision. You have gained new information regarding the quest Wolf and Fortress. Yeah, we gotta check all of these out. All of these three new quests that we have. Obviously the Wolf and Fortress fortress is the last one uh i want the sword and the armor so let's see quest wolf and fortress madru zinan gave us the sage's key to break the barrier at the wolf and fortress but i don't remember seeing a keyhole in the barrier side quest apparently there's a level of the silvernian dungeon that has never been entered by man madru zinan gave us an amulet that will allow us passage and told 
a, a hero's sword was there. And then there's the side quest. Cigarettes opposite a sprawling underground dungeon called Inverse Babel was supposedly built by men who wanted to talk to the devil. We need the amulet of despair to enter this place. Wow. Let's see if we can use this ultimate fire attack here. Nice. Oh, it only killed two. Gosh darn it. Ooh, I think this is the path um, that leads to the Amulet of Hope's Light is stopping the cold air. Ooh, so we can get to go down now. That, What is this? Examine the magic circle. Jeez. Again, we're attacking an enemy that he's not necessarily examine the magic circle. There you go. Shaped like a square. Examine the magic circle. Alright. Ooh, something moved a bit. Alright, let's activate this. Examine the magic circle. Nice. Hey, look, there's a chest. 45,000 Gelders fight now, so let's cross our fingers. Examine the magic circle. Mmm. What is happening? Ooh, boss fight. Let's do. Ooh, who is this? Humans, what are you doing here? It's been two millennia since I last saw a human. Who are you? I'm Ellie Kaiser, the Silver Dragon. Now, can I kill you all? What? <laughs> Wait a second. We're only here to find the Hero Sword. It's supposed to be in this dungeon. Have you heard of it? Hero Sword? I can't believe there are still those who desire the legendary weapon. I really must slay you now. We have come here under Maju Zenin's guidance. This amulet proves it. Maju Zenin? Lady Lord of Fate? What is she thinking? Well, you'll need to show me more proof than that amulet. Have at you. Alright, let's see. Right off the bat. Grace of God. Now, she has a shit ton of HP, so we're going to use the combination skill here. Ten thousand! Wow, that was great. Um, we're going to use Blade of Fury. Blade of Fury! Geltz is gonna throw an Ambrosia. Actually, he doesn't need to use an Ambrosia. But here's what we're gonna do. Alright, we're gonna use this to kill everybody's MP a little bit. We should be free from damage here. Alright, let's see if we could use Grace of God again. We're gonna use her to do another 15% damage with Wave Strike. Eight thousand. We're we're doing lots of damage. Um, he needs more MP. That is obvious. So we're gonna do a strong MP recovery for himself, and uh, we also need a strong MP recovery for, or medium MP recovery, whatever, for Latic. Grace of God again. She's going to do the same. Um, wave strike. I'm about to use an Ambrosia. Just, well, actually, do I have an emergency potion? Yeah, I have three, so let's see how this does. This is good enough. 
Um, and does he have a thing to increase everybody's attack? Or defense? Increase attack! Alright. Why can't I do Grace of God? I don't understand. Why can't I do Grace of God? Let's do Wrath of God since we can't do Grace of God. That's kind of annoying though. Because it, it sets us up to possibly get hit now. Why can't she do Wave Strike? I'm going to throw an Ambrosia here. I'm really nervous. My hands are sweaty. Let's go. Doomhammer? No Let's pray she doesn't kill us all. Oh my god, she's almost dead. Come on, come on. There was a lot. Oh, yes! <laughs> yeah, we got her. <laughs> Holy shit, everybody leveled up so much except for Killian because he's dead. <laughs> 50,000 Gelders, 800 SP, Miracle Amulets, Platinum Medallions, all types of crazy stuff. I guess it's really true. I'll give you what you're looking for. You may need to leave here, though. It's no place for a human. Use the Amulet of Hope and acquire the Sword of Soon Soon. Don't come back here again. You have completed the quest, Hero's Sword. Wow. That's where I have to end the stream today. Thanks everybody for watching. In the next stream, we're gonna try to get the legendary, uh, the legendary armor for this game. 